Hey, what's up guys, it's Brian here, Brian's All Maintenance. All right, a question I get asked a lot, the stripe game. How do you get your stripes to look so good? Now, I will tell you guys straight up, I'm gonna give you three tips, three, not really secrets, just three best practices to help you guys out with uh, if you wanna lay good stripes. Now, here's the deal. Uh, a lot of you guys uh, up here in the Midwest, and uh, we're in Michigan, we have Kentucky bluegrass, and it stripes really well. As long as it's green, it's not going dormant, um, you can stripe a lawn spring, summer, fall, right? Uh, I'll give you guys a really big tip though that not too many people know, which I didn't know until just a few years ago, is that when you're striping with a mower, the goal is to go from blade tip to blade tip, not wheel to wheel, right? So let's look at, let's look at a stripe really quick here. You guys can see we have our wheel mark here, our wheel mark here, but we went blade tip to blade tip. Now this grass was really long. This is like four inches, it's the first thing in the morning. Really dewy, really wet. It would stripe way better in the afternoon, okay? But if you guys can see all the way down, we don't go wheel mark to wheel mark. There's actually a little bit of a gap here if you can really tell the fineness of the line. We go blade tip to blade tip. That's how you get those really crispy lines with a zero turn, with a lawnmower, with a stand on. It's all the same. So, for example, let's say you're in the seat, and this is the same thing if you have a push mower, you have a stander or a zero term, when you're coming down the line, it's almost like this is kind of hanging out of your peripheral vision. It's almost like you can't keep track of where the deck is. That's how close you have to make that tip. So if this land is cut grass, you want to line it up to literally where you only have an inch of grass going under the deck. It's got to be almost perfectly edge to edge. And I'm curious if you guys run your business the same way, if that's how you guys lay stripes. Same thing on this side. The blade tip is going pretty much to the end of the deck on the discharge side. But you guys can see, the blade tip is about an inch longer than the wheel uh, well, the wheel uh, width, right? So same thing over here. The deck is gonna hang out. So you don't wanna line up wheel to wheel, which is what I always used to do. It probably comes from using snow blowers because you always have to kind of on a snow blower or a push mower, you're always kind of using uh, a two-thirds pass. On a zero turn, you want it to go tip to tip, which is deck edge to deck edge. Now, here's the deal. Quick little uh, three tips that I can give you guys if you want better uh, lines. Number one, freshly sharpened blades. It's not that hard to do. Uh, get them done at your dealer. Buy a blade grinder. Actually, I'll leave a card here. We had a really good blade grinding video. Uh, some of the best tools that are available for homeowners, DIYers, small business owners to help you guys do uh, fresh sharpened blades. But number two, clean the underside of your deck. Clean the underside of your deck, scrape it off uh, in the morning, scrape it off once a season. If you're a homeowner, maybe once a month if you're a homeowner, uh, the more wet or dewy it is, the more likelihood you're gonna have to, you know, you have that clumping, right? So you wanna make sure that you're scraping the deck as off as you can. That'll give you the most uh, airflow, the largest vacuum, the largest baffle the, that sucks it all up, makes that grass stand tall. It makes it really nice and even. So we got fresh blades, we're scraping out the underside of our deck, and the third one, like I said, or number three, right, is make sure you're going tip to tip, edge to edge, not wheel to wheel, all right? So if you do that and you got uh, Kentucky bluegrass or uh, grass that is nice and lush like this, you know, every region's different. I don't know how they do it in Florida, but for up here, everybody likes the stripe game. Everybody appreciates all those, those uh, that golf course look, and that's how you keep your customers happy. That's how you keep everybody uh, coming back year after year, right? So anyway, do you guys have any tips for uh, laying down stripes? Do you guys have any tips for making the grass look super nice? How do you guys keep your customers happy? I'd love to know your guys' thoughts, your guys' tips. If you got some good ones, leave me some comments down below. But just a short, sweet, fun video for you guys about how to lay good stripes. By the way, if you wanna follow us on Instagram, we're always laying down the stripe game and keeping you guys uh, uh, updated live on Instagram. All right, guys, over and out. If you guys enjoyed the video, shoot a big thumbs up. Check out these other videos here if you guys are new. And guys, we'll look forward to catching up with you on the next video.